Hi everyone, today in this video, I'm gonna show you how you guys can install Spotify on your Spotify. Simply means customizing your Spotify. Woo! So, head over to this link, I will link down under the description down below. You guys will need to download Spotify PC version instead of uh, Microsoft Store version over here. So, if you guys have installed this, you guys will need to uninstall this. And then download this Spotify from the description down below, I have you in the link and install that on your computer all right and it should just look like this not the square square button like <gasps> that. all right so once you guys have downloaded and installed this now head over to the spicetify.app and this is how it should look like now you need to click on install now and here is the installation guide for you so this is for windows and if you guys are using like another operating system you will need to prompt the terminal or shell on linux mac os and follow this command all right first you guys will need to copy this to copy you can simply click on this button over here you can see there's a copy button so just click and copy head over to the powershell all right now search for powershell so this is how it should look like your powershell now run this as administrator this is how it should look like you might be on the blue so my is in black right now so it doesn't matter at all so just right click to paste your command this is how it should look like and now tap on enter and right now it's downloading this spicetify for your spotify and it should be right away you know like install it on your spotify dashboard so make sure that you guys are already logged in as well you can also log in later you know it doesn't matter so let it be installed All right, so you can see it's been installed. Now, one last command we need to install is the marketplace. So uh, we need to install marketplace so that you can um, apply themes from there. All right. So once again, copy the second command over here by clicking this. All right. And then right click on PowerShell and tap and enter. And there you go guys, so if nothing else happened, do Spicetify apply. So now it's saying that if nothing has happened, like if nothing has happened on your Spotify, like you, you didn't see any kind of marketplaces uh, where you can access all the themes, extensions, and all the apps, you know. So if you guys don't see the marketplace, then you need to do Spicetify apply, all right? If you still doesn't understand what I'm talking here, just copy this. Just by you know like right click and paste that Spicity Fi apply and tap and enter and it's going to apply uh, the modification that it have done for you. So it's relaunching the Spotify for me since I have already got the marketplace. It doesn't matter for me. So go to marketplace to apply the themes. So go ahead and click on themes here and then you need to find uh, the theme that you guys wanted to apply. So basically I will apply this one over here which is burnt Sina. Let me install this. So this is how it should look like your Spotify has been customized. And you can see my library, the colors of the player, everything has been changed. So you can also try out some extension if you guys wanted to install some extensions. And there are also snippets. Like you can see you can hide the upgrade button that I have done as well and you can go to apps you can check it out all the things all right so you have now installed spicetify now you guys can customize yourself so this is it this is how you guys can install spicetify on your computer and apply some awesome and dope themes all right so this is it guys so thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video peace